Hey, what's going on y'all? This is Mr. Fitness, the body transformation specialist. And in today's video, I'm gonna share with you my one tip, that one thing that you can do to lose weight fast. That video starts now. So one of my Instagram followers recently DM'd me and she had a question. So I figured I'd answer that question in video format. Here's the question. She said, Mr. Fitness, I love your Instagram posts and all your motivation. It's been really inspiring, but I have a question. I have my daughter's wedding in a month and a half and I need to lose about 10 pounds. What would you recommend me do to lose that 10 pounds before her wedding? So Stacy, don't worry, I got you. Thank you for following me on Instagram, and here's the answer. So if I could choose only one thing to do, and there's many things that you could do, but she wanted to know that one thing that I would have her do if she was going to lose more than 10 pounds over the next six weeks, that one thing that I would have her do is intermittent fasting. So over the last few years, intermittent fasting has become a very, very popular way for people to lose weight. So I'm not gonna get into all the details of what intermittent fasting is, and maybe I'll do another video on exactly everything intermittent fasting, but to keep it simple, intermittent fasting is where you eat the majority of your calories, or all of your calories really, in a very small window. And the reason why intermittent fasting works is because you're keeping all of your calories in a very small, tight window. So what that does is allows your body to burn off stored fat over the course of the day where you're not eating. So what most people do when they intermittent fast is they eat a late lunch and an early dinner, consuming the majority of their calories later in the day. But what I'm gonna do today is teach you a little trick we're gonna flip intermittent fasting on his head and that is where you're going to get the best results. So here is my super intermittent fasting tip. Instead of eating the majority of your calories or that small window the later part of the day, eat your calories during the earlier part of the day. Now, if you've been doing intermittent fasting already and you've been getting great results, then I'm not gonna tell you that you need to change what you've been doing. But just by making this slight change, you will probably see that much better results. I mean, some of my clients that have intermittent fasted in the past and now change to doing it this way, notice faster results and longer lasting results. So here's why this tends to work a little bit better than the traditional way of intermittent fasting. See, now we all know that later in the day, your metabolism naturally starts to slow down and your metabolism is the rate at which your body burns calories. So by eating the majority of your calories earlier in the day, at night when your metabolism is naturally slower and you're already gonna be burning less calories, you have less calories for your body to store. See, what happens when people tend to eat the window of calories in the evening, they're eating their calories at a time of the day where their metabolism is naturally slower. So what happens is the later you eat, the more calories your body is going to store. And we all know that when our body stores calories, it stores the majority of them as fat. So to avoid that from happening, you eat the majority of your calories or your small window in the daytime. So what I normally do with my clients and for myself is I'll eat a late breakfast and an early lunch. And what you're doing is you're eating the majority of your calories during a time of day where your metabolism is naturally faster. So you're gonna burn more of those calories throughout the day and you're gonna store fewer of them, giving yourself better weight loss results. So there you have it, Stacy. my one tip to help you lose that 10 pounds before your daughter's wedding. Oh, and by the way, here's a bonus tip. To give you that one, two weight loss punch and help you lose maybe even a little bit more, I suggest carb cycling. 
Now, if you want to know more about carb cycling, I've created a carb cycle diet. I'm going to leave a link down below in the description so you can go ahead and check out Mr. Fitness's carb cycle diet. Well, that is it for the video, guys. I hope you liked it. I hope you got something out of it. And if you did, make sure you like, subscribe, share, and comment. This is Mr. Fitness, the body transformation specialist, signing off. And as always, where there's a will, there's a way. And I hope you have an awesomely great day. Till next time.